What if one day in a heated argument, your mom confesses to you that she has always been a lesbian and is not at all interested in men? Will the world come crashing down on you? <laughs> well, don't get me wrong there. I'm just telling you the plot of the recently released film Majama. Is it worth your watch? Let's find out. And if you want to watch this video in Hindi, then click on the link in the description. The film begins with a dip involving a lie detection scene that looks farcical and unreal. But soon after, it picks up pace. Pallavi, a middle-aged woman, played by Madhuri Dikshit, confesses to her daughter Tara that she is a lesbian. Tara is also an LGBTQIA plus activist. Now this news spreads like wildfire in the Patel household and brings in the expected unrest and discomfort of accepting their godlike figure being abnormal or unnatural. On the other hand, Tejas, the Patel's son, is all set for his engagement. Tejas is madly in love with this rich millionaire girl, Esha, whose parents are so unbelievable and cringeworthy to watch that in one scene, they literally ensure that Tara is not on her periods before accepting a cup of tea from her. These USA-based parents, uh, Bob and Pam, played by Rajat Kapoor and Sheba Chadda respectively, are just another caricaturish version of a bad American accent trying to be hilarious. This American accent comes and goes according to the convenience of the screenplay. Rajat, in one scene, is finding it so difficult to say Bharatiya Nari, whereas in the pre-climax, he speaks long phrases in Hindi better than the native Hindi speakers. I feel that these American parents reduce the niche of the film to some extent. Now, if they were to be rich, they could have been from any other metropolitan city. Like they could have uh, used Hindi instead of English, just so that this film could reach out to more Hindi speaking audiences. Because at the end of the day, it is a film which requires audiences. Despite all these minor flaws, there are some good standout scenes. The first one being when Madhuri Dikshit comes out of the closet. Look out for the closet in her background. It remains open. The other scene uh, on this ropeway involves Shiba Chadda, Simon Singh and Madhuri Dikshit. That scene will make you rolling on the floor laughing. And the final one, I think it was the Vaigra disaster scene involving Manohar, played by Gajraj Rao, who roams with an uh, erection. That scene is hilarious. Despite the successful light scenes falling in place, the film lacks to delve deeper into the complexities of the characters. The good part is that all the characters have a solid backstory, yet the film shies away from telling us the real hardships, from taking us there where we could literally feel that this is something realistic. If Pallavi was living a life for the last 30 years, so was Manohar. If Pallavi gets a chance to redeem herself, so should Manohar. Well, by the end of the film, somewhere you would realize that Manohar has also been betrayed. Another question that stayed with me, what about these partners now? What about these lovers? Will these women like get to lead a normal life after this? What is going to be the equation? What about the children? How are the dy dynamics and the equations at the Patel household going to be? These are the questions that I do not have answers to. To sum it up, Majama is a good film and deserves your watch. At the end of the day, it is an important film that speaks about LGBT acceptance and LGBT rights. Majama is streaming on Amazon Prime videos. And if you have already watched this film, do let me know your thoughts in the comments below how you like the film. If you want to see more reviews like this, hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, share it with all your friends, and I shall see you next time. My name is Navjot. Goodbye.